I've been told that I was very hyper in my first video, so I'm going to be much more serious now. For your convenience, I'm going to go through every letter and pronounce it along with some examples. A. Art. Aeroport. B. Bahar. Baida. Ch. Chavetta. Chaita. D. Dar. Daula. E. Elf, Euro. F. Fiura, Frot. G. Gnin, Gdid. G. Gzira, Gvern. Ein. Ein. Er. Akka. Ia, Ua. H. Hruj, Halib. I. Id, enti. I, e hor, e af. I, yum, yew. K, karotza, knisia. L, leil, laham. M, mara, meida. N, nofs, nis. O, om, ochra. P. Post. Pagina. E. Attus. Al. R. Ragel. Rahal. S. Saha. Star. T. Tri. Tabib. U. Ukol. Uniku. V. Vapur. Vicin. W. Wehead. Weed. Sh, Shemsh, Shita. Z, Zibel, Zgur. C, Celcet, Zokor. As you can see, most Maltese letters are always pronounced the same way. There are some minor exceptions. The letter E can be pronounced differently in different words. For example, Bir, Min. As I mentioned in the previous episode, silent letters uh, are pronounced at the end of the word or when followed by another silent letter. I also mentioned that the letter EIN may modify the vowel next to it, which created some confusion. Now, let me explain. Take an example of the word TI. Now, I pronounced it TI, but in some dialects it's actually pronounced TA. And the most direct way to pronounce it, and the way that they pronounce it in Cotonira, in the Free Cities, is T. Another good example is the word AUM. It should theoretically be pronounced UM, but because of the AIN, it is pronounced AUM. But I mean, seriously, this is nothing. Nothing compared to English pronunciation problems, where you can have three different pronunciations in two words right next to one another. So now you can see that reading Maltese is not a problem at all. However, writing Maltese... Pro tip! Learn grammar first, then learn how to speak Maltese. The other way around, you're gonna go crazy. Cha... Za zuch... Ah... 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 Ah!